like something that you would read in uh, some of the novels on serial killers and so forth. What exactly happened inside James Worley's barn is still being investigated, but psychologist Charlene Castle says the emerging details are horrific. According to search warrants, a hidden room, evidence of blood, and cameras allegedly all over the property. All these pieces together seem to me to indicate somebody who was into a serious pattern of activities, sadosexual activities are what comes to mind. We know Worley was convicted of abduction back in 1990. Castle says it's unlikely Sierra was the only one since then, blaming his rural area for allowing him to operate under the radar. I would suspect that there's a possibility of uh, other victims who either did not survive or who got away. Since the incident, the Metamora community has told me they're afraid for their families. Castle says we just don't live in a time when you can bike ride alone. You're always much safer if you're with, uh, with your friends or relatives or whatever. And as for Sierra's family and those working this investigation, Castle says it's important to talk about it. This is beyond the unusual. I mean, let's face it, uh, the murder of a young girl, it just traumatizes everybody.